we're going to do is, what are the short vowels? Our short vowels are letters that are A, E, I, O, U, and they all have a short vowel sound. For A, we have A says A, E says E, I says I, O says A, U says A. Uh. Now I'm going to give you a chance to say the short vowel sounds. So A says A. Ah, great job. E says E. Eh, great job. I says E. Eh, great job. O says Ah. Great job. U says, uh, great job saying those short vowel sounds. Now we're going to listen to a song that kind of gives us to remind us what our short vowel, short vowel letters say. listening to that song and I hope you're singing along with the A-E-I-O-U. So now what we're going to do is we're going to use those short vowels and we're going to create some words. So we're going to start with the first pattern A and T. Now remember our A says A ah, and when we add a T to it our word family is going to be so listen to me first. Our first word we are going to do is we're going to add an S in front of that at family. So we add an S in front of at. It makes s at set. Now what we're going to do is you're going to put your three fingers up in the air and we're going to say each sound of the word and then we're going to blend it together. So we have s at. Sats. Great job. Now that one I kind of gave you as a little model. So this next one we're going to do together. And I'm going to give you a chance to do it on your own too. So now we know that at is in there, but now we added an R to it. So I'm going to give you a second to try to sound it out on your own.
Great job, friends. So now we add an R in front of our at. We have er, at, rat. So now put your three fingers up and let's do their sounds together. R, at. Now I want you to do it on your own. Great job, friends. Our new word is rat. Let's add a M in front of it. So again, we're adding a M to our word family at. So I'll give you guys a second. I want you to sign out the word this time. Great job. So when we added M in front of our at, it makes M at mat. And if we put our three fingers up, Let's do our sounds together. M, A, T. Now I want you to do it on your own. Great job. Our word is mat. Now let's do the pattern I, N. Remember our short I says I. And our N says N. So we put it together, we're going to have N. So let's see, if we put a T in front of it, let's see what our new word is going to be. If we have a T and we add it to our N, we will have T N. Your turn. Great job. So when we add T N, we have the word 10. Now let's put our three fingers up and let's say our sounds together. T I N. Now your turn. Great job. When we put T I N together, we make the word 10. Great job. Let's move that T over there and add a F. So remember, our F says, so we add our F sound to our N. Let's do it together. N. So what's our new word? You're right. Our new word is thin. So let's put our three fingers up and sound out them together. N. Your turn to do it on your own. Great job. I n makes the word thin. Our next pattern we're going to do has our U T. So remember our short U says uh and our T says t. So when we put our new family together, we have so let's add a C in front of this one. Remember, our C says K. And if we add our K to our new pattern, let's do it together. K, ut. So our new word is? Great job, friends. It's right. It's K, ut. What makes cut? So let's put our three fingers up in our air and let's sound out the sounds together. K, uh, t. Your turn. Great job. So we have k, uh, t. Our new word is cut. Great job. Let's add a n in front of it. So now we're going to have n in front of our pattern, ut. So what would be our new friend, our new word, friends? Great job. If we added n in front of ut, our new word is nut. Now put your three fingers up. And let's sound out the word together. N, a, t. Your turn. Great job. If we did n, a, t, and we blend it together, our new word is nut. Great job. 
Our last pattern we are going to do today has an E. So remember our short E says E, and we're going to add a T to the ending, which makes our pattern ET. Let's add the word key to it. So now we're going to add our G in front of ET. I'm going to give you guys a second to figure out our new word. Great job. If we add a G in front of ET, your new word is GET. So let's do our sounds together. G, E, T. Your turn. You're right. G, E, T makes the word get. Let's add a L in front of it. So we add a L in front of our pattern et. What's our new word? You're right. It's let. So let's do our fingers up and sound it out together. L, E, T. Your turn. Great job. If we do L, E, T, our new word is let. Great job, friends. I hope you guys really enjoyed kind of our lesson. To sum up our phonics lesson for today, we are going to play a game called Beat the Clock. So I'm going to set this one minute timer and I want you to sound out the words and then read them and see if you can beat that timer. You guys ready? Set. Go. Great job, friends. I hope you guys got through those six words. So let's do our words together. So our first word we know is t, app, tap. Our next one is r, ip, rip, k, ut, cut, l, ot, lot, l, egg, leg, in fin. Great job, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed our phonics lesson for today. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.